Gallagher Estate played host to a standing room only press conference to welcome the Brazilian's highly recommended and very experienced new Pathfinder. Uh, it's my absolute honor and pleasure to introduce the new coach of Mamelodi Sundowns. His name is Johan Nieskens. Can you clap hands for him? I'm very happy to be here, first of all. I want to thank the club uh, that they brought me here, that they gave me the opportunity uh, to work for the club. I went with the age of 18, I went signed for the club Ajax Amsterdam. We won three Europe Champions Leagues in a row and make my debut for the national team. And uh, well, in 74, uh, it was my first uh, world championship with the Netherlands. And after that uh, period, I went signed for uh, Barcelona and uh, played together also with Johan Cruyff. I, I won uh, as a player 10 prizes, so that's a lot. But to achieve that, that asked for a lot of work, discipline, commitment, and also a winning mentality. For us as Mamelodi Sundowns, the pattern of football that Barcelona plays is in line with the pattern of football that we are popular for. Shoeshine and piano. If I go to a different country, I have to adapt on the culture of that country. I don't want to change any things, only the way of working I do. But for the rest, I don't want to change anything what is against the culture of this club. I grew up uh, playing football in a 4-3-3 system. I like to play attractive attacking football. Of course, it's beautiful also as a player to play because you play the game with a lot of one-two touches. We call it total football over here. They know it also here. They call it piano and, uh, and shoe shine. I think we, we have the quality players to do that. So uh, that is the philosophy that I want to make, that the people who are coming in the stands that they enjoying watching the game the way it is played and hopefully also with good results. In every competition that we participate in, we don't only want to win, we want to win very well. Those expectations are no dissimilar from the ones we've made in the past. Last year he was fourth in the league but only two points behind the team that, uh, that was champion. Then uh, that gap was not too big. And uh, you cannot reach something without discipline and working very hard. And that I expect not only for my team, but also for myself, for all my technical staff, for the medical staff, and also all the people who are working in the offices. Because we have to be one big family together with our uh, fantastic fans. Johan Cruyff is, of course, his history is, is not only you know, premier football, but it's also his capacity to develop uh, young talent. We're working with the, the Sundowns Academy, and the idea is to have a really a world-class academy. Our main responsibility here from the Johan Cruyff Football Development Program is to bring in some youth coaches from, uh, from Holland and from Spain, but also uh, working with the local coaches and get out to the satellite towns to develop youth. And then ultimately our job is to make sure that uh, Coach Neskins has, uh, has a look at uh, two or three homegrown players to take a look at seriously for the first squad. You need to combine the best in terms of the God-given talent which is unique, which we have to develop with the most advanced methodologies in the world in terms of young children from a young age doing the basics and the technical part of football correct. From the youth academy on to the first team, everybody should play the same system. And these players, when you play the system, nothing is new because they, they start learning that already with six, seven, eight years old. And they go through the whole process. And when they're 17, 18 and they have a lot of quality, they are ready for the first team. There is only one star, and that is the team. And that is what everybody has to work for the team. When you have the ball, then you are attacking as a team. When you're losing the ball, right away you have to think defensively. And uh, that is how you can get some good results by working as a team. The players uh, had to have four or five weeks to go on vacation. So they're coming back and they are eager and they want to work. But our philosophy is to start up slowly the intensity of every practice. By us, it doesn't go about the quantity of the practices, but more on the quality. So I'm looking forward. People have to know that I'm going to give 110%. I try to do my best, and uh, hopefully we're going to be successful, But because I think it is time for this club. After so many years, they didn't win anything. I think now it is the time to come back and uh, win some prizes. Sky is the limit, sky is the limit, sky is the limit.